security guru here about to show you guys how to do port forwarding on Hikvision DVRs. If you don't have a static IP address, please continue on to the DDNS setup. First, right click on the screen, go to configuration, go to network, check DHCP to get the IP address from your router, hit apply. Once the IP address is populated, uncheck DHCP to keep it permanent, and then hit Apply. Now go on your computer, test the IP address that you saw on the DVR, log in, enter your password, then click on Configuration, go to Network, here you will see the gateway address. This is the address of your router. You can also go to the port settings and double check which ports are being used by the DVR. Once you have these information, click on a new tab and enter the gateway address to enter your router. Each router has their own passwords and different areas where you can do the port forwarding. Here as an example, it will be under virtual servers. Enter your password and start entering the information. The name doesn't matter, but the port, make sure it is the same port as what you saw in the DVR and also the last digit of the IP address that you saw in the DVR. Hit save and allow the router to reboot. Once the settings has been saved, you can double check your port forwarding settings by going to canyouseeme.org. Check the ports and you will see success. This means that your port forwarding has been successfully applied. Next we will be configuring the DDNS. Click on configuration on network Click DDNS, enable DDNS, and enter the address name you would like the DVR to be. Hit save. Here you will see save successful, but we need to double check to make sure that it is successful. So click out of the DDNS and click back in, and you will see connecting. If the connecting status does not change to enabled, that means we need to change the DNS server on the DVR. You can do this by clicking on DHCP, go to the DNS server, we will use the Google one, which is 8.8.8.8, .8 hit save. Once you go back to the DNS settings, you should see it now connect and say enabled. Now you are set. Thank you for watching. Hope we answered all your concerns and questions in regards to setting up your DVR into the network. If you have any other questions, please comment below. And don't forget to subscribe and give us a thumbs up so that we can go ahead and make more videos for you guys. Thank you.